Okay, what we're going to do today is introduce a dog or start teaching a dog how to work a windshield wiper. We teach, talk about telling, teaching a spaniel how to quarter, working back and forth in the field in a windshield wiper pattern without the three man drill. This is something that you can do in the beginning stages when you've got a young puppy. You can start it right at 12 weeks old, teach a dog to work back and forth in the field. I like to use uh, hand signals, whistle, and also my body to get them to move back and forth, okay? And teaching them the windshield wiper pattern. As you're doing that and the dogs get better at it, once you get your dogs into birds, you can start to roll birds for them on one side or the other and give them a few fines. But when they're puppies, we teach them how to retrieve. We can start doing this quartering in the field, okay? We use, you wanna have three whistle commands to use, okay? Two pips to turn the dog. If your dog's out too far, you want to turn them to head in the other direction. They quarter the other way. We use two pips. Okay. We want to uh, draw the dog in. What I mean by drawing a dog in, the dog's out too far in front of me. I want to bring the dog back to me within a reasonable amount of distance and then give him a cast. All right. I don't want the dog to come all the way to me. I just want to draw him back in to get him a cast because I may feel that. Hey, in a hunt test, um, uh, you have to cover all the ground before you move forward. You don't want to pass a bird because if you pass a bird, especially in the senior master level, um, you're not going to qualify. So you may your dog may have punched a little too far. You want to draw him in to cover a specific area in front of you uh, so you can move forward so you can get it to the next bird. Uh, my whistle command for the draw is just a long whistle. It's a Then I'll, I'll draw the dog into me to where I want the dog to come in and then I'll give the dog a cast to left or right and get the dog to cover the area that I felt the dog has uh, missed, okay? Um, a complete recall, calling the dog all the way to you. Um, some uh, trainers use different uh, whistle tones. I use just three pips. It works for me um, and that goes like this. Okay, that's my recall. That tells the dog I want the dog all the way uh, to come all the way to me. Uh, sometimes, if I get a long mark out there, I see the dog make a pickup. Uh, I may want, I may hit that recall whistle just to let the dog know that uh, they get a general idea in his, in his hearing as to where I'm at. So he, he pinpoints me to come back with the retrieve. So I'm going to take a young dog. Um, I'm going to work around some quartering here in this field. The cover is not too too bad, um, and um, We'll give you a, an idea of just how um, I work the dogs and get them ready uh, for the three-man drill. We've got gunners on both sides, and we'll be getting the dogs to really do a windshield wiper pattern. This is the pre-stage before that. So we'll get set up. Uh, we'll get a young dog up, and um, you can watch me um, work a young dog in a field where I'm working with um, hand, uh, voice, whistle, and body language to communicate to a spaniel when I'm working them up in the field.
Okay, as you can see, she's starting to get it. She's running a little, a little sporadic. The wind's at my back, but if you continue to drill them in this fashion, and if you can, when they get into birds, start giving a bird on either side, their patterns start to flatten out. This just gives them a general idea that you want them to work from left to right of you, and in no time they'll be working a good pattern, and they'll be ready for the three-man drill. Come on, girl, let's go. Get out. Get out. Very good. Come around. Here, here. Up. 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 Now, as you can see, we ran two quartering patterns with this dog, and I ran in two separate directions. First time out, I put the wind at my back, pushing her away from me. Okay, here. Second time, I put the wind in my face. Got a better quartering pattern. Dogs will work differently in the wind direction that they have to work with. Continue to do this, and your dog will be working a very nice, uh, windshield wiper pattern. We'll be ready for the three-man drill. Come on, girl. Let's go get some water. 